Researchers at Xavier University found hospital beds aren't as clean as most of us think. They found infectious bacteria in the very place that's supposed to make us better. In fact, according to the study, 85% of both mattresses and bed decks tested contained several bacteria. Ohio News Network's Lot Tan has the story. This is not a one hospital problem. This is pervasive. Even though the study looked at five hospitals in four different cities, Dr. Eddie Hooker, the author of the study, says everyone needs to be worried about catching a potentially deadly disease when they enter a hospital room. If the patient that was in the bed before you had VRE, which can be fatal, just like MRSA, if that patient had that disease, I was infected with that, you have twice the likelihood of getting an infection. Dr. Hooker says hospitals, not just in Ohio, but everywhere, need to be more aggressive with disinfecting rooms. He advises patients to do two things to protect themselves. Look for visual clean. That's the only thing that they can do. And make sure that every single person, if they haven't washed their hands, don't let them touch you. Medical Director of Infection Control at Tri-Health Hospitals, Dr. Stephen Blatt, reviewed the study and says there is a very small risk you'll get sick by dirty hospital beds. We think most of the infections that are picked up uh, are acquired by bacteria that already exist on the patient's skin. Dr. Blatt says workers use Clorox bleach on top of standard cleaning to reduce infections, and TriHealth is also studying other options to make sure patients are safe. A new UVC machine that releases UV light that uh, greatly reduces the amount of bacteria in the environment, so we're doing that. In Cincinnati, I'm Law Tan, the Ohio News Network.